so this episode we certainly did learn a lot about family history and what I mean is that um Yurdo's mom she you know died um I think he said before he can really make any memories with her but I think but I think you know she died <coughs> at, um, you know not as a complication well maybe as a complication but he says that she died before he can really make any memories for her so she died when he was really young and the interesting part is that apparently um the stepmom you know uh when the dad remarried it was the sister of Irudo's mom so I'm kind of having trouble like maybe before like if Irudo's mom was alive or when when she was alive I think by law or something that they were Irudo and Yume were already connected by law you know probably like cousins or something but um yeah, probably they didn't even notice, or they still haven't noticed uh, the thing. But um, moving on to the rest of the episode, the rest of it is just um, Irido and Irido and uh, I think her name was Yume or something. Um, they you know decide to spend the night somewhere else because you know they feel bad that. Their, their parents didn't get to spend like a honeymoon type of day. You know, just those two together um, with no, you know, interfering from the kids. So they decide uh, to sleep at the hotel and they, they kind of, they kind of end up sleeping at, spending the night at their friend's house. And we also learned that, you know, they they coincidentally live their neighbors coincidentally and um while they were talking uh, they confirmed it confirms that um that you know they still have feelings or know that the friends did go out with each other Domi Nami and uh, his friend K I think they did go out back in junior high but um yeah, and then um, towards then, it just gives me a feeling that, you know, Iwido's completely move on from Ryume, like, is that the point where he doesn't really care anymore, he, like, moved on with his life, but it seems to me that Yume, or his stepsister, they were, um, she still has some lingering feelings for him. As if, you know, they're trying to get back together, but, <clears throat> but yeah, um, that was the episode, um, overall, I really enjoyed the episode, it was very, it wasn't very impactful, but we did, we at least learned some of, some of the lore, and, uh, in their situation or whatever, but, um, yeah, overall, I enjoyed this episode. It was really great. I can't wait for next episode. And you know. How are they going to incorporate that character. That you know. In the OP. But she's still not. She still hasn't been introduced to this. To the story so far. So I wonder. You know. How and when they're going to introduce her. Maybe by next episode they will. But uh, who knows. But um, yeah great episode can't wait to review the next one so please leave a like subscribe and comment your thoughts and opinions down, down below thank you and i'll see you guys next time bye